Guys, how long have I been saying that I love G-Shock watches in my videos? Well, guess what? They finally heard about it. And they sent me a care package. I'm Adam, and that's Diesel. He's from the desert, I think. Or at least that's where he was found wandering around by himself. So I adopted him, and now he's a beach dog. It was always my dream to move from England to live in sunny Southern California, and now here I am. My goal is to inspire people just like you to chase your dreams, and most importantly, get out there and find your everyday adventure. Guys, I am so excited. And actually, I almost spoiled this because when this package arrived, I feverishly opened it and then realized that no, you guys have been here since the beginning with me saying how much I love G-Shock and how much getting recognized by them would be a big deal to me. And guess what? They finally heard and they sent me a little care package. So this came from G-Shock Australia of all places. So not even G-Shock US or G-Shock UK, no. This message that I love G-Shocks went worldwide. And so G-Shock Australia very kindly sent me this. I don't know what's in here. I do, well, I'm lying to you. I know that it contains watches, obviously. And I also know that it contains some type of merch because when I opened it, I could see it here in the top. But I haven't looked at it, I promise. I literally opened it and I was like, no, save yourself. Let the viewers get into this with you. So with me together, we are gonna see what G-Shock have sent me in this little box of goodies. Okay, so uh, I guess let's put this to the side. Let's start with this. So it's a t-shirt, let's see. Yes! Uh, look at that, G-Squad. G-Squad worldwide, and then on the back, G-Squad Australian chapter. So I am now an official member of the Australian G-Squad, having never been to Australia. That will change, by the way. I definitely have plans to go there, but that's killer. So, all right, so we got some merch, first of all. That's very exciting. Um, should I try one of those really, like, weird transition things? <laughs> How cool is that? All right, so we're now repping the merch. Let's see what... <gasps> oh, my goodness, guys. Look at this. Look at that. One, two, three, four watches and some crumpled up paper. You guys, Australia G-Shock, G-Shock Australia. All right, where do we start? Okay, which one do we start with? Through the camera, I want you to tell me. Ready, say it out loud. I'm gonna do one more loop, and then you're gonna say stop. Ready, three, two, one, tell me when to stop. This, this one? Okay, all right, good, thought so. So what do we have here? <gasps> all right, let's see. If you guys have never unboxed a G-Shock before, this is what it looks like. I can see neon yellow through here. Whoa! <gasps> guys, we, you guys tell me to stop on the right one. Look at that! It's, and it's actually my yellow. It's not like a, like a crappy green. That's actually my yellow. Whoa, look how good that display looks. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh my, like, look, when I say it's the correct yellow, like, it is the correct yellow. It's the yellow, I don't have any of my swords merch here, but it's the right yellow. So this one, in case you're wondering, is the G-Shock GBD 209 dr oh yeah look at that that's killer activity no oh it's a smart watch oh so this connects to your phone wait is that a, what's that is that a micro sd no <laughs> i thought it had a micro sd slot inside that would have been funny wouldn't it so we got the stopwatch this display is incredible i am blown away like that is surprisingly clear and crispy well, first one down, and we're off to a flying start. Okay, so according to the G-Shock website, this does all of your usual G-Shock things. So obviously shock resistant, you've got 200 meter water resistance, and it also has a training function uh, so that it will measure distance, speed, pace, and other calculated values based on the accelerometer, and also features inside of this watch. So this thing's legit. Uh, also le reading down through these uh, things, it says one of the features is it's a vibrator. Let's get the next one out. So excited, is that metal? That it, that is metal. No way. Whoa. Okay, so if you guys watch one of my older videos, you'll know that I had a G-Shock sent to me and it had a metal case and a metal band, kind of looked like an AP. Well, they were like an aftermarket add-on and I think G-Shock have paid attention because they're now offering that same one in actual, wow, look at that, in actual metal. That dial is killer. It's like a gray, like cool brushed finish. Wow, and the head of the watch is all metal. So basically what it was, this watch was called the Cassie Oak because the shape of the case kind of looked like 
a Royal Oak offshore, an AP Royal Oak. And so they nicknamed it the Cassie Oak. And if you put it on a bracelet that looked like the AP bracelet, the whole thing just kind of had that look about it. So obviously G-Shock have paid attention to that and come out with their own version. So this one is the GM 2100 180R, in case you guys want to look this up. Wow, that is upside down and gorgeous. Ha! Ah, that's so, it's actual, that's actual metal. Wow. So this thing has just your typical G-Shock functions. It's in a smartwatch. So you've got your stopwatch, your world time, alarm, all that kind of stuff, uh, dual time zones. And on the dial here, you've also got the days of the week indicated with a cool little hand that sort of moves between them all. But that is beautiful. I really like that. That dial is gorgeous. The nice thing about these watches is that you can change out the, the straps on them. They actually have a quick release strap. That's so cool. Awesome. G-Shock, thank you so much. I'm so excited. I can't believe, guys, how long have I been saying that I love G-Shock? And people have been like, you should be sponsored. You should be sponsored by G-Shock. I even got Michael Blakey, producer Michael. I got him into G-Shocks. That's how much I bang on about them. So to actually have them finally recognize that and send me this is so cool. By the way, this isn't a paid endorsement or anything. They just hit me up on Instagram. And they're like, hey, we've seen your videos. We know you love the brand. We want to send you a care package. What's your address? And that's it. That's where we're at. Dun, dun, dun. Let's see what we've got. Wait, did... hold on guys. Okay, one of my favorite sayings other than find your everyday adventure is, if some is good, more is better. And what is better than one Metal G-Shock? Whoa! So this is another, I, why can't I figure out how to get these things off? Well, there it is. So this is another GM1200, so with the metal case, but this one has a red crystal on it. That is beautiful. I love that. I can't believe I have two metal, I have three metal G-Shocks, two OG like genuine ones and one after my. That's so cool. So we got the one with the silver metal and then we've got the one with like the, I don't even know what you would call that, but like the black metal. Which one do I like the best? I like them both. <laughs> I like them both. That's so cool. You guys do not realize this package has been sat waiting for me to film this video for about a week. It's been over here in the corner of my office and every time I've been sat here editing, it's just been like, like you know, um, what was it? What game was it where like you get a little thing and it would like jump around and like little sparks had come out of it because you had to go and open it. That's basically what it's been doing sat over there. What a lineup. God, I have got so many bloody G-Shocks and I love it. <laughs> Save the big daddy for last. What is this? What is in here? Oh, okay, there's a model number. If you know G-Shocks, then I'm gonna spoil this for you, but it's a DWE 5600R 9DR. I have no idea what that is. Oh, but I see yellow. Hello. Why is this in such a big game? <gasps> Whoa, it's like a build your own G-Shock. Look at that, you can build your own. So you could put like yellow on a black strap or you could do red on a red strap or you can do black on a red or black on or yellow that's so much fun without reading the instructions let's see if i can do it how does this come off do you just pull it off is there a tool g-shock how do we do this yep oh, whoa and then underneath it just looks like a cool little like retro one ah that's so cool you could like oh quite happily just rock it like that and then it's got the quick release strap so you just come in here. You, I might need some type of tool to do this. Stand by, stand by. Okay, so you just get in the back here and just clip. And there we go. That's the bracelet off. So that's got a black clasp. Clip. There you go. So then you just got the head. And then you can get your red one out or your black one. So you got red, got black, and you got yellow. Look at that. I wonder if this is like some German special edition one. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? I know exactly what I'm gonna do. We're gonna do yellow on the head. No, we're not. We're gonna do red on the head. So you literally just snap this over, that like that, super easy. Then we're gonna do black on the top. <laughs> okay, moment of truth. Ha! <laughs> Look at that! It's got all the colors on it. That's so cool! I wonder if they do like different ones, if I can get like neon yellow or... Look at that, 
It's all different colors. That's so fun. I love the fact they're going back to like the retro thing now. That's just such an awesome direction for the brand. And uh, yeah, that whole nostalgic thing is definitely a thing right now. So there you go, guys. That is my new selection of G-Shocks. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below which one of these is your favorite, which one of these you would rock. Do you know what? I'm gonna see, I can't promise anything, I can't promise anything, but I'm gonna see if I can't get G-Shock to agree to do a giveaway. Because I would just love to get some of you guys wearing these watches, and I'm sure G-Shock, they've sent me these, they know who I am now, yes, finally. Actually, do you know what? Let's try and get this video as many likes as we possibly can so that I can go to G-Shock and say, look, look how good this video was, look how much my audience loved it, and they would love a giveaway. So if you guys would like a G-Shock giveaway, smash the thumbs up button, and we'll see if we can make that happen. I will try my absolute best for you guys, and uh, yeah, we will do something special for sure. All right, guys, well look, thank you so much for watching. I am over the moon right now. I don't know which one I wanna wear. Uh, I think I wanna wear the... Thank you for the support. Thank you for watching these videos. If you aren't subscribed, please do subscribe because I would love to see you here again. And from the analytics, I know that 65% of you watching this video right now have not hit the subscribe button. I say subscribe at the end of every video, so there is no excuse. Please, right now, I would really appreciate it if you just go down, hit that subscribe button. It takes no time at all for you guys to do it, but it makes a huge difference to me, and it really does help support this channel and let me continue to make content that hopefully you guys are enjoying. I really want to get to that 100,000 subscriber mark. We're not far away now. So yeah, please do. Just give it a little click, just right now. I'll wait, I'll wait. Thank you, apart from you. I know you didn't do it, but to the rest of you, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will see you guys on the next adventure. Uh, I have some cool stuff coming up. Actually, in a few days time, I'm picking up another toy. I'll give you a clue. It's fast, it's fun, and we're gonna go on some cool adventures with it. So I'll leave you with that. All right, guys, thank you so much. Uh, love you, remember, until next time, don't anything I wouldn't do, and find your everyday adventure. I can't high-five the lens because it's too far away, so I'll just do a beautiful fade to black and load up on that cool shot of me riding my jet ski. See you next time.